Well, this evening, getting word of an amazing survival story. Yeah, this is incredible. An elderly man trapped inside his car in a snowbank mm. for nearly a week. Our Sarah Donchi is here with his amazing story. Sarah? So the man you're about to meet survived all of that time on a few snacks, a croissant, some candy, and a biscotti. Here's the story. 81-year-old Jerry Duray set out from his house in Big Pine, California on February 24th to return to his family home in Gardnerville, Nevada. Normally, that's about a three-hour trip. According to his grandson, Christian, Joray thought he could beat a coming snowstorm. He was wrong. He had checked the Caltrans website to see if the roads were clear, and it, you know, gave him the green light. But um, as he left about 30 minutes from the house, I believe he slid off the road and got stuck on the side, and that's when the blizzard hit. So the snow starts coming down and it really piles up as much as three feet. But here is when his survival instincts kick in. Duray is a mathematician and former NASA employee. So he stays with his car. He conserves the vehicle's gas and battery, only turning it on for short periods of time to warm up. He's rationing his snacks and occasionally rolling down his car window to eat some snow. The search team was supposed to go out days prior, but the weather was so awful they couldn't get a helicopter in there. And, you know, days were going by where they couldn't get to him. And uh, finally, you know, I prayed about it hard and uh, prayed that the weather would change. And the next day, it was the most beautiful uh, day we've had in weeks. But even then, the rescue almost did not happen. A CHP chopper pilot spots what he initially thinks is a large rock, but then takes another look and he sees the SUV and Jure's arm waving out the window. He was flown to a hospital where he was checked out. He was in incredible health. You know, the vitals were looking great. I think he was just mildly dehydrated. That was it. So, Ryan and Liz, throughout all of this, he was only wearing a light windbreaker. Not good. And I can bet you guys are reevaluating the kind of snacks you <laughs> yes. are at this very moment. <laughs>